Okay, back. I welcome you all to my channel. This is my first video ever. I hope you like it. My name is Happiness. My brand name is Happy Sculpture. And on today's section, I'm going to be teaching you basic measurement, basic body measurement. Yeah, if you want to be a pattern maker, this kind of measurement is for you. You know, in making a dress, we have two types of measurements. We have the pattern making measure and the um, free and method of making a dress. So if you want to be a pattern maker, this video is for you. So guys, this section will be needing just three things for this class. One, your book for measurements. Let me show you my your book. Then you can get a biro or a pencil right here with me. It's a pencil and your measurements. Oh, it's more than three. Yeah, one, two, three. Then somebody to measure. Like right now, I don't have anybody here. So I'll be making use of my mannequins. Look at this, my mannequin. It's a, it's a pattern draft mannequin. You can look at it. There is this lines, they call it pattern block lines. Yeah, for making patterns, you can make a pattern on it and you can say to make a pattern on your table. So, but I'm going to be measuring because our today's class is on basic bodies measurement. Bodies measurement. So, okay, before we continue, I would like you to note this, to note this down in pattern making when okay when making your patterns or measuring rather when measuring you advise to go with the same you know we in the tape this is my tape for measurement the tape measurement your the, the tape measure rather we if you you guys are familiar with some freehand we always go with this inches when when measuring our client or customer but when you want to make a pattern to make a fitted dress you advise to use the centimeters the small 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 numbers side yeah reason because you will get your accurate figure when doing your maths you know in fashion today it doesn't matter you do your calculation minus and subtract you had there is a lot in pattern making so for you to get your accurate figures you advise to use the cm's this the cm side not the inches side so we're continuing take note of these these are the measurements you will need. You need the chest width measurement. You will need the bust. That's the true bust line measurement and the upper bust measurement. Write it down. Chest width, true bust line, the upper bust line. We have the waist. We have the hip. We have the shoulder. We have the back to length. Yeah, back to waist line. Not what you know as half length in free pattern making not in free hand in pattern making we call it your from your nape from your back to length waist yeah that's our own half length here yeah. so we have the full length your desired measurement length then let's flow as i take it through 